As Christ loves his church sacrificially, will you commit to sacrifice yourself for Angela's sake? I will. As Christ loves the church above all others, will you vow to delight in Angela alone? I will. As Christ provides all that the church needs, will you vow to provide for Angela? I will. As Christ makes the church more like himself, will you vow to point Angela to him in all things? I will. As Christ leads his church, will you vow to lead Angela as you follow Christ? I will. As Christ serves his church with the best possible care, will you vow to serve Angela with humility, patience, and love? I will. And this time you will answer with, I am. Trent, having made these commitments before God and these witnesses, are you ready to see your bride? I am. From the first moment you held my heart in your hand And wherever you okay, okay. is a place that I wanted to stand From about 2015 to 2018, Trent was was like my right hand until you came along. I truly believe that God brought us together and that we are meant for each other. Two years after moving to Columbia, enter Angela. Little did we know, just a few years later, you two would be getting married. If you would have told me all those years ago that the flirting back and forth through your calls to Lindsay and calling dips on you to all of our friends would have actually ended us here, I would have told you that you were crazy. I feel like we should collectively. I oh, know. <sighs> What's up? Yeah. Thank you. I'm gonna go on the grass and ground. Tonight love you so much and you're both getting a great person today you were a heartbeat dreamer never scared to chase the mystery you were a wing clip white light you love each part of me and inspire me to be the best version of myself and to spread the love and kindness You've shown me to everyone I meet. It's not a statue. You, Trent Barber, bring so much joy and love into my life daily. You really are the flashlight in the darkness. You're my flashlight in the darkness, baby. When I think about you and me, I think about our first day in Clinton. I think about driving to Columbia every weekend to see. I think about a small two-bedroom, one-bath house in Korea, where so many memories were made. With this room, I be wed, I be wed, in the name of the Father, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. And I show you love you. Today starts our journey in life together. I promise to always give our love and marriage my all. I can't wait to live this life with you and see the world and have adventures with you by my side. I commit to make you a priority. I commit to always be ready to take spontaneous trips with you. Yes, even Europe one day. I commit to love you the same today as I do in 20 years. You're my flashlight in the darkness, baby. You're my electricity. I've always wanted a sister, and I can't imagine welcoming anyone to this family other than one of my very best friends. I vow to always be there for you, fight for you, and stand up for you when you need me to. I promise to make life fun 
and always cherish our marriage. I promise to always love you in every way I know how and always show you in every way I can. I, Trent, take you, Angela. I, Trent, take you, Angela. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. Before God and these witnesses. To be your loving and faithful husband. To be your loving and faithful husband. You're my rock. You keep me steady. And I cannot wait to spend the rest of my life with you. I need. I've known Trent for a long time. I've known him well for a long time. And I can say without any doubt that uh, I've never seen this level of dedication, commitment, and love. Hi Angela, take you Trent. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. Now by the power given me as a minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ. She's pretty excited. <laughs> I pronounce you to be man and wife. Trent, you may kiss your To the bride and groom, to Trent and Angie, I wish you a lifetime of dedication, commitment, and love.